Welcome back everyone, I am the Depressed Eeyore, and this is Sid Meier, Civilization V, a Tellus uh, playthrough. Where we last left off, the Incans are dicks. They converted our city to Christianity, and I want to fix that. Um, unfortunately, it's going to take two turns before I can get an Inquisitor up and running, so I can start purging this out of here. But, um, we'll just have to deal with that. What wonders do you have? You don't have any. Okay. Well, while well, that's going, let's go ahead and go to our next turn. Uh, we're right now in a golden age. We just finished Tosh Mahal. Um, I went ahead and traded all my resources, uh, spare resources to um, other civs. Actually, do you have anything? Uh, never mind. You don't have anything. You have no money. Wow, you're broke. Good for you. Maybe you should have used that... Uh, Thing for something better. Whatever. Ah, uh, your movement's down to three. Okay, whatever. Um, do nothing for a turn. Nobunaga is making the Hibiji Castle. That's fine. That's what my spy found out. Tech what? Wow, potential. <sighs> okay, so they don't have much. Anything? No. Sometimes you can get things where they're like they're planning stuff, and you can trade it to um, or give it to other cities, uh, other uh, civs for um, you know, friendship points or whatever. Prophet, are you serious? He's just dumping prophets on me. How is he getting so much faith? What a dick. Well, I can tell you right now, it's cheaper for me to get um, Inquisitors, so I'll just purge it out, I guess. It's gonna hurt, but not much I can do about it. Alright, well, it says I want science in this marsh. So here you can have science in that marsh. I wish I had like a, a, something that allowed me to tell him to stop doing that. Not that the AI ever listens. I like how there's always those options to discuss or demand stuff like that, and it doesn't matter because they don't do anything. <laughs> They'll just keep doing it, just like how the how the kids are still trying to spy on me. All right. Well, we'll see what they do. Seriously, I'm going to take that profit. I will happily declare on you. If I declare, it makes me a warmonger. Ten science from this, wow. Just stay on alert. Alright, 
well, I got an Inquisitor at least. I'll do this little faith war for the time being, I guess. Wow, he's taken over his entire continent, hasn't he? Congratulations. Oh, he didn't make it. Aw, poor him. If he had, it would have said he made it, but he didn't. Yay, my keyboard lock again. Come on, get your turn done. Thank you. Okay, that's not helping. Hey, when the key... It's really dumb how the keyboard locks like this. I mean, come on. <laughs> oh, they're at war. That's why it's... Industrialization based on machinery already refer Alright, we found coal. There. And there. They'll fix it eventually. Alright. So we got that going for us. Um, and we'll be able to start making factories once we get a hold of coal. actually like label them like as you make them but uh, you won't know until you after you make them that it's going to be a Christian so yeah that's happening but yeah I mean I don't mind losing but this that was dumb I'm not going to take it <laughs> not accepting it Especially because it, apparently if you do that, it makes your city no longer a holy city, and that's not what I want right now. So there you go, that happened. Let's go next turn. I can use like an inquisitor 
to like, I don't know, explode a prophet. I wouldn't mind that. Industrialization based on machinery. That's done. Are you leaving? Are you are you gonna leave? Wee. Alright. Hello. Hey Askia. Ay gati askia sungai. Good to see you too. Erga mila aiga adilei. Amma bay kul kandir de kubay zarira. Kula saburiga. Masite tabasi matkaldadi. Okay. Let's talk. Nigogane. We got wine. I have truffles. Give me 213. Atiga buri. Good man, good man. Nigogane. How about... Eight gold per turn? Seven gold per turn. Um. Thank you. So we got that going. Um, Askia, he's 546. And if we look at our demographics, he's not even on the board. Um, I'm now in the lead in population. Probably because of some... I'm guessing a war is probably doing that. Other than that, uh, we're in the lead. Good to go. Yeah, they're up to samurai and crossbows. That's pretty good. As for you... Next turn. is they're both an inquisitor and a uh, missionary they will con they will literally convert uh, one religion to another rather than having to do the steps of purge and then and then convert so it's very very annoying let's go ahead after you go to sleep because right now I'm also getting I'll eventually start getting pressure on my other cities uh, about Christianity and that's not all this been a while purging it all. Alright, that's taken care of. Let's go this way. So there's only one other Civ I've imagined. I'm pretty sure that's Gandhi. No. <laughs> You're not getting my truffles. I'm taking my truffles back. You're converting my religion. And apparently there's no option to tell them to stop. Alright, I can adopt a policy. Um, plus two science for every specialist, or I can get plus one uh, 
local study happiness from every university observatory and public school. Plus one gold from science buildings. Kinda want the, uh, plus two science first. But... From science buildings. If I get this, it'll make it so all my science buildings pay for themselves. So we'll go ahead and get this first. Give us another boost in, uh... Alright. You got anything? You have nothing. Hey, Oda. Oh. You... I've already given you everything. Alright, so ask... Uh... How's it... Alright, not you either. So, only you. You have well, you can't have my marbles, but you know what? You can have my marble. No, you can't have my marble. Screw that. That gives you 100 bonuses. Alright. What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? You converting my place? Doing something? भारतीय जनता की ओर से मैं आपकी ओर दोस्ती का हाथ बढ़ाता हूँ। I have truffles। हाँ। Give me seven twenty। Thank you। All right, have we gotten our Good stuff. Let's. You know what? Hey. 
Hey Gandhi. मैं आपकी शांति की कामना करता I'm gonna go ahead and move my spy over. There's literally... He has nothing. So I'm gonna go ahead and go to... Delhi. Okay. I'm gonna go ahead and move you from Kyoto to Delhi. And that'll work. So he's just kind of hanging out there. He's not doing anything. And it looks like I'm subscribed. It feels like I'm getting less followers of Christianity as it goes on. So I don't know. Things always seem fairer when we look back at them. So there we go. We got the Borson Tower. Good to go. We got ourselves another great scientist, which I don't even know where I'm going to put you. he actually pops that great profit, I'm good to go. Um, there's not enough followers for it to be, follow Christianity anymore, so it won't spread the religion any further. Academy there, trading post there. Why is there a trading post there, of all places? Okay, you know what, we'll put you up there. I'll be getting a golden age in a few turns. But anyway, if we take a look at our demographics, um, yeah, Japan's kind of taking a lead on a lot of stuff. Probably because it's taking over cities left and right. Aske is doing the worst. Incans aren't doing much better. So there you go. I'll lose a little gold, but you know what? More science. I wonder, is there an option to kill you? No. <laughs> Alright, that's done. Do we have access to coal yet?
Also, there's coal down here, apparently, that we just got access to. Probably gonna go ahead and save my money and do another, um, spend money on Genoa to make sure I stay happy with them. missionary. Oh, they're they're having a little religious battle over there. Good for them. And someone spread religion all the way over here. Good for them. Um, luckily, I'm sp I got to these cities first, so that's not a big deal. It's been like in my borders for a while now, and I don't understand why it's not degrading, I guess. But whatever. So there you go, we got that going. Purge that out. And this place is obviously going to get plenty of religion. Alright. Excuse me. You know what, just for that, I'm keeping this city. Might as well. Gandhi has entered the industrial era. Good for him. I'm hoping the Incans don't do back-to-back -back freaking profits again, because that's what just happened, I mean. The one it attacked me, initially converted with, uh, was one, and then they immediately sent a second one. Was not fun. Wow! Oh, that's Indian. Okay, that's fine. I was like, wow, that's another Incan prophet? No, different colors. Though not too different. They're just reversed. Alright, um, we need to f purchase another Inquisitor. Yeah, I'm gonna have to do Inquisitors. I can do a Missionary to kind of get some of my faith back, but that freaking Prophet's just gonna convert everyone, so I'm just gonna purge it as he uses it. So, get that taken care of. Good to go. 
This video is probably going a little long, but that's alright. How you doing, Askia? Not too bad. Oh yeah, how you... Okay, that... Okay, Delhi has a little bit more potential than freaking Japan does. So, we're gathering intelligence to see what, if we can steal some tech. Today, and we got ourselves a great artist. Congratulations. Alright, well... I'm gonna go ahead and save this one. I'm gonna have great. I'm gonna have a golden age soon enough, so I'll save this and then I'll uh, use this as another golden age in a sec. Longer you wait, the uh, the worst it's gonna get. India has denounced Japan. Ika no ken ni tsuite go sandou itada kereba. Done. Makoto ni arigataku. Good for you. He pretty much just offered to keep doing the deal, so I was like, okay, fine, I'll take your money. Hello. What's going on there? Okay. He's friendly with us. Friendly. Well, let's discuss. There used to be that option in, in um, Civ 4 where you can ask what they think of the other Civs, but apparently that's no longer there. So, wow, he's got a lot of stuff. So really the only threat is kind of Gandhi as far as like wonders and culture and all that junk. Not a big deal. And Askia has Stonehenge. Okay. So... I'm really concerned about this. He's friendly to me, but it's apparently not going to be good enough. The good news is, okay, he does have a pike. He does have a pike. So we need to start upgrading. The good news is I do have access to cannons. So let's go ahead and... Um, Upgrade that unit. Just in case. I don't think I have any use for you now. I'll go ahead and give you up one. Because you don't need to stand there anymore. So I'll just head on down. As for you. I finished building all the stuff I was building originally. Good. Let's go ahead and get the factory up. Add you. Not much I can do about you guys. Yeah, I'm really kind of nervous that the fact he's right now at my border. I mean, he doesn't have quite enough to, like, instantly take over a city or anything ridiculous like that. But he will definitely cause some chaos. 
if uh, left alone. Yeah, I'm not sure where he's going. I mean, it's very rare. boost our military strength a little bit. Like I said, they're moving across my coast here, and that's not good. I wonder if my Great Wall still works. <laughs> only when I discover dynamite, but I'm not going to have dynamite anytime soon. Well, unless I choose to get it. Trebuchets. Alright, um, do nothing. Do nothing. Hey, Oda, do you got anything for me? Oh, just listen to I'm a little nervous that you're doing this guy. Tell you what. Mm, that's a little much. Tell you what. Give me 68 gold. And 5 per turn. Mana. Fine. I'll give me a little boost of money. And if they decide to attack me, well, I'll be ready for them. Alright, we can work towards the Louvre, but I kind of want to get that factory. So let's get the factory. That's for you. But, uh, I can't check it. Alright. And we've already got our coal. Alright. This worries me a lot. Good news is I don't really have coastal cities, so they can't really harass them. Okay, they kept moving on their way. I mean, it's good that I upgraded those units. Okay, got Big Ben. Got a chemistry. Got a Golden Age. But, go ahead. Definitely kind of... there. Upgrade. We definitely <laughs> We can Oxford one turn Let's get Oxford for one turn <laughs> um, Other than that I say we go ahead and get some infrastructure And then go for the Louvre It's not a big deal As for what tech I would go for Probably electricity Probably They have muskets. Um, 
muskets are a little bit stronger than long swordsmen, but not by much. And cannons don't do too much against personnel, but it's better than nothing. I mean, if I... Okay, yeah, I'll be alright. We'll manage. We always do. As for you, upgrade. We're still gonna be like bottom of freaking uh, military. Yeah, we're last in military. Upgrade you to a musket man. Bam. Which means I got an iron back, I guess. Oh. There it is. <laughs> Placing any trust in me was a mistake. Oh, very, yeah, you don't pay for this. Look at all those caravels. Hello. Hey, you got our legend back. And we killed an Incan spy. <laughs> so, yeah, that's happening. Um, So obviously the trade ended, but we got 60 gold out of him before he declared on us. So he stayed a patch. Oh, he has declared. Is that you? No. Is that you? No. Is that you? No. Then I don't care. I don't even know what that city state is. Sorry, drinking some apple juice. All right, free tech. We'll go ahead and get electricity. Is it? Um, as for anything else, well, we'll go here. Alert. I mean, look at my shock. Look how shocked I am that I've been. I just been attacked. Unfortunately, I probably shouldn't put. So yeah, this is happening. Um, since I have war's been declared, I don't have to worry too much about. Oh, I guess the uh, profit's gone. So let's just go back up here. Get rid of that. But yeah, war's been declared. They're right now attacking Jerusalem, but. Luck taking out Jerusalem. So we 
we just gotta hold them off from here. But that's gonna have to wait till another time, because right now this video's gone a little long. So, we'll leave this on a cliffhanger, I guess. So, until next time, everyone, I'm Deed Rustior, and this is Sid Meier's Civilization V, Gods and Kings, until this playthrough. Next time, we're gonna be fighting the Incans. See you guys.